Hey guys, this is Mahak, your civil bro. So today we'll start a lecture series on SAP 2000. So we'll start from the very basics. So let's go start. And if you like my code, make sure to drop the like button. So let's get started. So first of all, we'll go to file and we'll just create a new model. So the tab will open. So once the tab opens, we'll select the units here. So we'll select kilonewton meter and uh, this SI unit. So this country will select India. So we'll go with grids here. So we can see, so we'll have a six meter grid only for a beam and number of grid lines in the other direction will be one. And this doesn't matter. So six meter grid. So two grids will be there and click on okay. So uh, here we have this. So first of all, we'll define uh, the, you know, uh, properties here. So, so we'll go to define, define materials here, and we'll just go add new material and India, and we'll select the concrete first. I'm 25 grade concrete, okay. And add new material, India concrete rebar, we'll just go, and FE 550 HOST, okay. Click on okay. And then we'll define the section of the frame sections. Just uh, click on add new property to go with concrete and rectangular. And let's put B. 250 cross 350 the name and uh, 250 and this one will be 35 concrete grade m25 concrete reinforcement this and cover let's go 35 mm since this is for the, up to the center so 35 minimum 30 will be kept and then click on this cross I forgot to give this type click on okay right so once you do that beam property has been done uh, then you can go to define and you can define the load patterns so dead load uh, usually when we calculate in books we don't take the self weight so let's not take, take the self weight here that's for the same results so just go zero and click on modify load patterns it will be modified and this is fine so uh, once this is done and then you can simply click on this and uh, the properties are okay here continuous b to 350 just click here and click here beam has been done right click outside so the beam uh, is outside just double click on escape two times and select this point and then just assign the joints go to joint go to restraints let's assign uh, let's say let's go with fixed first fix support uh, apply and okay so this is a fixed support which you can see here uh, fixed support has been applied so now six meter uh, is the beam fixed support is uh, the support condition so first of all let's just apply a point load so select this uh, and then go define and uh, sorry click on go to assign and we have the frame loads frame loads go to let's take, take a udl per distributed of minus not minus you don't need to be minus since the gravity direction so go with uh, let's go 10 and click on apply and then click on okay so 10 has been applied here and once this has been done just uh, click on analyze and run analysis a model let's uh, not run this only dead load let's, let's run run now save the file and the analysis will run and show you the results so uh, now if you want to see the form shape so select so like the window in which you want to see let's see this uh, let's take this 3d view and uh, in the show uh, the form shape here and uh, click on apply so it will show you the deformed shape here Okay, and if you want to see in this view, uh, let's go X, Z, it will show you better kind of the elevation. So if you want to see in this view, you can also see it here, click on apply, click on, okay. It'll also show you. Let's go back to the X, Y, okay. Go here, show the form shape, apply. Okay. Or let's go 
okay it's okay if you see if you see here and then if you want to see the courses here so select this window first and okay select this window and go to this show courses and then frames cables so let's see the share course first we want values click on apply so you can see the share course here and if you want to see the bending moment click on moment 3 3 click on apply so this is the bending moment which you see here now if you want to see both just right click you can see bending moment shear force diagram here along with the values so like this you see the values for a cantilever beam and like this you can apply different uh, you know support conditions apply different loads so let's see how to apply point load as well so this will be very interesting to how to apply point load so simply unlock the model first and uh, for applying the point load uh, let's go with this at the this point so first of all select this and uh, go to define and sorry click on go to assign assign frame loads and point so the distance from absolute end and distance will be six and uh, it will be in the global and that is gravity direction okay so the load will be let's say 10 kilonewton and it will replace existing load so that you know the UDL will be replaced click on apply click on okay and uh, go to analyze and see this to run analysis and click on run now so it will analyze and you can also see the animation also okay for the deformed shape so let's see the bending moment here so first of all go and uh, show undeformed shape this is undeformed shape now show the deformed shape apply and okay so the deformed shape is this one and now to see the bending moment forces first of all undeformed shape and then the bending moment shear force frames cables bending moment show values click on apply so if you want fill diagram just, okay, just click on fill it will show the fill diagram and uh, just right click here will show the bending moment shear force diagram for this so you can see deflections resultant moment moment shear the resultant shear and moment so everything you can find from here and if you want the values obviously you can show values it will show the values so like this we can draw the shear force and bending moment diagram of the beam uh, next well, you can draw various support conditions fixed uh, you know fixed pinned roller everything you can apply here and you can check the venue and the shear force diagram for this and in the next video we'll do uh, a particular frame and we'll analyze it and see the results so stay tuned keep learning bye bye